candidates for Virginia's governor set to debate just hours from now and you can watch it right here on News 3. Democrat Terry McAuliffe and Glenn Youngkin are meeting for a debate tonight in Southwest Virginia. They're first ahead of the November election. News 3 reporter Brendan Ponton joining us now for a preview. So Brendan, what are we expecting tonight? Well, a big moment in this campaign. The two have been going back and forth all week on social media, but tonight for the first time, they'll be debating each other in person as we enter the final stretch of the campaign. The debate over whether or not vaccines should be mandated, a flashpoint in the Virginia governor's race. Democratic nominee and former governor Terry McAuliffe supports them for jobs like health care workers, nursing home employees and federal workers. I want to keep our schools open. I want to keep a booming economy. It's not going to happen if we don't get people vaccinated. While Republican Glenn Youngkin says he encourages people to get a shot, but doesn't support mandates for any job. I wouldn't mandate it. For people and it's and I believe people need to be able to make their own decisions. The two sparred on Twitter earlier this week with Youngkin saying he wanted to film a PSA at tonight's debate with McAuliffe in support of people getting vaccinated. McAuliffe responded calling the tweet a gimmick and in recent interviews with News 3 both of the candidates attacked each other over the issue. I'm running against someone who actually doesn't believe you should have mandates on vaccines. To me that is disqualifying to be governor. You got to keep your community safe. President Biden uh, and you know, he wants to mandate everything, and, and my opponent Terry McAuliffe does as well. And they come from they come from a, a political place that they think they know better than everyone. The latest polling in the race shows a close race. The Real Clear Politics average of the polls gives McAuliffe a five-point lead over Youngkin, 46.5 to 41.5. Democrats have tried to cast Youngkin as an extreme candidate. Glenn Youngkin continues to advance this dangerous right-wing Trump agenda, and. He's made it clear he will drag our Commonwealth back backwards. Virginia Republicans did not respond to a request for an interview today, but have repeatedly attacked McAuliffe today on Twitter over his record on law enforcement and saying he's all talk. With early voting beginning tomorrow in Virginia, Dr. Eric Claville, the director of the African-American Center for Public Policy at Norfolk State University, says this could be a feisty debate. So I think they're going to be laser focused. They're going to be prepared, but I believe that we're going to see uh, some very tough responses toward each side. And so early voting begins in Virginia tomorrow and will last until the Saturday before Election Day as tonight, the first of two debates in the governor's race. I'm Brendan Ponton, News 3.